Hi guys, it's Rizalka, and today we're going to be playing Blood of the Sacred, Gabriel Knight, Blood of the Damned! Or technically Gabriel Knight 3, Blood of the Sacred, Blood of the Damned. So, yeah. Still playing these out of order, since I started with 2, now it's 3. I guess I'll play 1 afterwards, but yes. And, um, yeah, it's on blip because I'm doing half an hour episodes, get over it. Um, so yes. Things to mention. Yeah, that was important. Um, <laughs> the um, yeah, there was a graphic novel that actually came with this game, where they basically just came out and said, you know, Gabriel got hired by the House of Stewart uh, to protect their son. Woo, freaky. Um, from the night visitors, you know. And, um, oh, Charity James is Grace Nakanamura. Yeah, she's not technically Lee Rami, which was the original, but hey, you know, she does well enough. Uh -huh. Does it say who's playing Mosley? No. I don't think it's... I don't think it's Mark Hamill, or they would have put it in the credits. Um, it's a good interpretation of it, so, you know, it's possible. And... Uh, Oh goodness, sorry. Um, hmm. I can't think of what else to say. Oh, you know, so... No, I've lost it. Oh yeah, so... Basically, the night visitors came anyway, so he followed... They Oh, they... Instead of taking blood, which is what they usually do, they kidnap the child. So, he, um... Gabriel noticed, so he... Well, he noticed, ha ha ha. So he followed them to a train, and then they jumped him and hit him on the head and spoke shit to him and spoke shit to him in France and then um here we are up to speed so to speak hmm we got off train number three And yes, this is... It, they, they seem to really like to bring in something new every time they make a Gabriel Knight game. Like the first game they were doing, you know, artsy comic style. Um, second game was the, um, you know, FMV version. And this is their foray into the 3D world. Which, let me tell you, not so crash hot. But it was early in the games of, you know, in the terms of um, 3D gaming. So, yeah, they've got some really nice textures in here, technically. It's just a shame about the, um, the geography. With the trunk get off here by any chance. I got off here. Which I mean, that way, monsieur. That way, monsieur. Yeah. Thanks. Coiza. France. Oop. Let me help you, monsieur. I can touch you all over. There is a taxi up front. I'm French. We will be very happy together. Appreciate it. I always thought this shot kind of made it look like that they were still on the train, but they're not. So that was the intro, and before we actually go into the game, I'm actually going to turn up the volume. Because I don't know how that sounds to you, but it actually sounds rather soft to me. And that's not my audio control. So just one moment, and... One moment of unprofessionalism. You didn't miss much considering I just said everything. Um, the guys on the tr Whoa, too loud now. <laughs> the guys on the train said, um... They said Sangriol. Actually, they probably said different other things, but oh well. Day 1, 10am to 12pm. You could have read that and seen his beautiful eyes. Um... Usually I would control this with my um, my keyboard, but as you can see, it goes way too fast because the full power of my processor kind of pales in comparison. So we're going to have to use the mouse unless we're trying to whiz around and then we will use the, um, yeah. First, let's grab the other things worthwhile in our apartment. <laughs> our apartment. Take this. And I don't have a damn thing with me. 
Well, that's nice. That's not what I asked you to click on. So yeah, like, technically we could give them a lot of shit about... No. Okay, close the door. Oh, good God, there's a break in your hand. Can you come over here, please, so that we can get a nice little look at you for everyone? Yeah, he walks a bit slowly, but he gets the job done. Um, now... There are some things that you're going to look at and go, Ugh. Oh! that That is not a pretty sight. Hello. Um... Yeah. Uh, okay, it's a low poly model, but you know, a lot better could be done than this. He just kind of looks like an angry, an angry alcoholic dad with some, you know, with a straw hat. Uh, things I do like to notice though is that you can see his Schattenjäger, um talisman kind of poking out underneath his uh, shirt there, which is nice. There's nothing really out much else here. There is a bathroom, but there's nothing in it that you can grab for now. And yeah, there's lots of rooms up here. Nothing to do up here at the moment. Let's go down. Downtown. Life can be great when you're downtown. Alright, where's Jean? There you are, Jean. Let's go speak to Mr. Jean. He must be the hotel receptionist. Don't think he was on duty when I came in last night. No. But we can still ah, speak to him. You must be Monsieur Knight in room twenty-five. Yes. My name is Jean. Hi. If there's anything you need, no. I will be at your service most humbly. Oh. Uh, thanks. Uh, well, there is something. Um, tell me about Ren le Chateau. Is there anything I should know about the town? Ren le Chateau? We have no. a small town, but a rich history. Mm. I suggest Monsieur visit the Musée de Saunière. It's just down the road. Okay. Tell me about the men. Say, Jean. Jean. Have you seen two men with a large trunk around the hotel? Oh, Maybe, mais oui. Uh, they were in my bedroom. Checking in. Mm. No, monsieur. But most of the guests arrived last night, oui? And I was... Yes. Excusez-moi. Not on duty. Oh. We have a number of gentlemen staying at the hotel. As to their luggage, I cannot say. I cannot say. <laughs> Maybe somebody else who works here might have seen the two men. Yes, Simone. The night clerk is Simone. Simone. When she comes on duty this evening, perhaps Monsieur could ask her. Oh, I, I will. Well, that's cheerful. Makes me feel right at home. Well, it does, kind of, because it looks a lot like your father's painting. Um. I think that would annoy him. Damn! I want to annoy him. Look at this. There's some kind of book on the desk. Yes, it's a registry book. Good God, man. Mm, looks like these guests have all signed in within the last 24 hours. Will you read their names? No, apparently not. Because it would give away some other things. That you don't want to give away just quite yet. Alright. Come over here. Emilio! Let's introduce hey, yourself. Hey, how are you? Hi. My name's Knight, Gabriel Knight. How do you do? I am Emilio Baza. Emilio. My Great. chest is collapsing on itself. Are you a guest itself. of the hotel? Yes, yes I, I am. am. So am I. Surprising. Then we shall see much of each other. No. Yeah. Yes. I guess so. Uh, we we will see too much of each other in in you know the coming day. Nice place, huh? Yeah. Did you get in last night? Yes. Not too late, I hope. <laughs> not late, no. Did you drive in? A friend dropped me off. I'm not crazy about flying and owning a vehicle. <laughs> Such a nuisance. Yeah. Uh, I, I can understand that. And apparently that was the end of our conversation. I don't have anything else to say to him. Alright. Well, while Jean is at the window, come get this. It's a pen. It's a texter. Come get yourself a piece of candy. Because we like candy. Candy good. Mm mm. Candy good. Through the door. 